what's up guys man so in my opinion man cro coin and vss are so bullish that i think i'm gonna focus on them mainly for a little bit because there's no reason not to man this is the one that i want to tell people more about man there's it's such a great opportunity to get into man i just i can't be more bullish about any project man like the way i was thinking about it was like this was which, you know, you got, you got a company like Coinbase, okay? They did a, they did a public IPO. And their, their IPO, if I remember right, last time I looked at it, it was like over $300, you know? Or, or that's how much the per, it is per share for, for one Coinbase share, like in the market. So if the CRO coin is a direct representation of Crypto.com, and Crypto.com is the number one downloaded app for crypto in the Play Store, um if the crypto.com has the ufc has has the nfts the awesome loaded lines man great nfts check them out dude and they're going for quite a bit from what they're posting um so they everything's taken off of crow bro and, and it just went from from not hearing about them at all to just hearing all about them just left and right mm -hmm. man but um but man oh i'm see i done lost my train of thought now but talking about crow all right so Oh, man, I, I hate that I lost my train of thought. I forgot the hell what I was saying. But anyways, man, this coin is just so bullish, man. It's just going to keep going up. See, the, I was thinking about this, too. Is the only coin that's like this, that, that's had this type of advertising, is Dogecoin. But here's the difference. Is Dogecoin is is a shit coin it's it's a mean coin if you're into doge you know i was for a little bit too i don't mean to hurt your feelings i do believe doge is going to go up to a dollar if that, or, or and over that if that makes you feel any better but it has no real use case all right the only thing that that dogecoin really does is sits around and waits for elon musk to tweet you know you know on his porcelain throne and and you know they get to go up a little bit and um sadly you know it's been dubbed a, a pump and dump coin right now um, simply because it has no use case there. Anyway, I don't want to get to talk about Doge, but the, my main point in talking about this is that, is that whenever people, when Elon Musk would go on Saturday Night Live, when he tweets about that stuff, it creates this hype and this buzz around Dogecoin and people get to buy it in. But there's, whenever people start looking into it more after they've bought it or even before they're going to, they see that, man, this is, this is a joke. This is, there's no reason for this coin. There's no purpose for it. Like this is a huge risk. You know, and it's just pointless. There's so many other cryptocurrencies that are 20 cents and that are that are um, very bullish and going way over a dollar. So why take a risk on a coin like Dogecoin that has no use case that's 20 cents and, and maybe go into a dollar whenever it does? I don't know. Whatever. There's so many other coins. It just doesn't seem like the smartest play ever. Like why? And to me, it's like it's like pride, like 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 Dogecoin pride. Like, we've got to get over a dollar. We've got to prove the haters wrong. And I don't mean to be a hater, guys. I'm just trying to look at it realistically. But here we got Crow. This is what I'm talking about this right now. The difference is Crow. Crow has probably even more. Yeah, you can't even. You can't. I mean, all, all Dogecoin has it was the Saturday Night Live and Elon Musk. Man, CRO, they have got billboards in every major city across the world. They're asking people to post pictures of themselves, uh, like selfies with those billboards all over the world and saying, hey, tag us in it. They've got Matt Damon, all right? They got Matt Damon, boys and girls. All right, I know there's some ladies in here. But, man, they got Matt Damon for a commercial. They got, man, they got the UFC. Uh, they got, man, the, the, the soccer leagues, whatever that's called, football. <laughs> Uh, man, they got they got it all, man. They, all the sports, Formula One racing. They got the esports gaming industry, and all this is for the for the for the years to come. There's no coin, no coin on the market right now that's as valuable as the CRO coin, in my opinion. As far as as well, let me let me say that I shouldn't say that like that. It's kind of true, and, and, it, and it's arguably it's arguably, but but that's it's it's not though. It's not. It's under there, but it is the most undervalued coin in my opinion right now it, we're sitting at under a dollar that's laughable that's laughable it, we were sitting at like 30 cents and i was saying the same thing it's crazy that this coin that has everything going for it is trading alongside dogecoin it don't make no sense and I, that's when i knew i was like dude this coin is going to pump and sure enough i started telling my buddies about it and it flew all the way to a dollar and what we're doing right now guys is we're just retesting we're seeing the chart right now you're looking at this we come up here, we bounced. 
Uh, we're coming back down. It's probably going to go down to that 72. It's going to, they always hit that 618, man. But once they hit that 618, they usually bounce again. So that Fibonacci always usually, what it, what it usually does is, is it provides, um, um, a good, good, uh, levels of support and resistance basically. Um, and, uh, I don't want to get into a whole thing about Fibonacci, but, but look into them and maybe I'll do a video about it sometime, but they're very, 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 very useful. So um, I do believe we're going nowhere but up, guys. Don't freak out. Don't panic sell. Anything you can grab with Crow under a dollar, well, shit, anything you can grab with Crow under $10, in my opinion. That's just my opinion, though. But I really, I think this Crow is, this CRO coin is going up, 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 and it's going way up. And I think it's going to go up fast. This is, we're going to see a direct result of these. Oh, I, I keep not say finishing my thoughts, but... Whenever people look at Dogecoin, it's surrounded by FUD. So they get excited about it. And then when they when they see all the FUD that surrounds it, because it's so not bullish, if you really look into it, then they all sell off. It's like it's not worth it. But this one, this one's got so much hype surrounding it. And when they're looking into it, it not only, you know, it, the, it lives up to the hype. It, it, it lives up to what it should be and what it could be. And it's just like, man, it's got everything going for it. And it's so brand new, but so good. They like, they... They just did this so good, man, this advertising campaign. And I do, I, I think they're going to continue it. I think they're going to continue to reign. And I think that Crypto.com is going to take over, man. They already are, the, uh, from what I understand, I could be wrong here, but for, from what I understand, they're the number one downloaded app for crypto. I know I switched over, man. You got to stake your crow. Stake your crow, stake your VVS, man. I'm going to do another to uh, another video on VVS because, man, if you're into crow, you need to check out VVS. You have to, man. No, no, I shouldn't say that. I got to stop saying stuff like that. You should, or I would recommend, uh, in my opinion, whatever the words you're supposed to say, it's not financial advice, but the v VVS follows crow. So if you're making the money with crow, why not shed a few zeros with VVS? Because VVS is built onto the Kronos network so it's going to follow crow if you look at these charts here i can even well i don't know if i should try no because i don't know where it's at i don't want to mess up the video but if you look at the charts if you just pull them both up man they're identical whenever when crow dips a little bit uh vvs dips with it when it rises it, it literally it went on this tear uh, right here along with crow and now it's doing the exact same thing consolidating a little bit so guys i'm telling you very, 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 very bullish. Anything you can get, man. Oh, and I, I wanted to tell you guys this, man, if you're still listening anyway, is Christmas Day. Christmas Day, the Crypto.com Arena becomes the Crypto.com Arena. I'm sorry, I should have said the Staples Center. The Staples Center becomes the Crypto.com Arena. Can you think of that day, on the, all the people who haven't really even heard of this news yet, um, that aren't familiar with the subject, that, that that possibly are still thinking crypto is this this huge scam that now see that it's repre being represented on a massive platform like the Staples Center. It's the crypto.com arena. Like it just it puts a it puts a um, a stamp of authenticity on crypto in my opinion, um, in a, in a in a big way for a lot of people in the United States who are still under the illusion of a. Um, from a lot of these billionaires like Michael Pena and and uh, Warren Buffett and Donald Trump and 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 other, all these other you know billionaires that that were billionaires before crypto, they didn't need Bitcoin, they didn't understand it, and there's no reason for them to take the risk on it. They're making plenty of money doing what they do, so there's no reason to change it. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. All right. So, but what what they made the mistake, or in my opinion, made a mistake, is they started trashing Bitcoin. That they. they they, it's like they wanted it to crash. They wanted themselves to be proven right, like they're still in power, but they're getting swallowed up by crypto. I bet if you lined up all the players in crypto, along with all those people that they, that they say are the richest people in the world, I bet there's, I bet there's many players in crypto that are swallowing them up and they don't even know it, you know. But anyway, man, uh, Crow's very, 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 very bullish. Um, this coin is going straight up, guys. I'm, I'm telling you, it's going to go to the moon. I believe that this is not financial advice. I'm not telling you to buy or sell this token. Um, I'm telling you that that I am in this project and I love this project. I've never been more excited. I know that we're going to make a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of money in this project. And I'm excited about it, man. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for this uh, YouTube channel. Thank you guys for all your support. And I don't want to be too long. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to keep these videos short. So I'm sorry for talking your ear off. But, but anyway, I'll get back to you guys. Thank you guys. Have a good day.